Okay, in the last video we looked at creating authentic materials using Google Maps and Street View. In this one, uh, we're going to use the Tesco website to create an worksheet around products, uh, the spelling of products and their price. So we can use it as a literacy and a numeracy exercise. So to do that, we go to tesco.ie and click on this uh, option here get started that will bring you to the shopping page you don't have to register or sign in or anything like that you can still use it without being a registered member of the Tesco page we're going to use this section over here where you can edit your list so it gives you a text box and we type in the product we want to use for this example, I'll go for milk. And okay. uh, type in milk there and click on go. And we're going to do the same thing here. We're going to take a print screen of the screen, paste it into a Word document, and um, use that as the worksheet. So if you can see the picture of the milk carton here, and we've also got the price over here. So it's this section here is what I'm interested in for using in the worksheet. Uh, we're also going to need a Word document. So on our keyboard, click print screen, open up your Word document, right click and left click and paste. Paste in a screenshot of your screen. Click on the picture and then click on the word format choose crop and then crop your page down to the area that you want so we just want the area that has a picture of the product and a price like that when you're finished cropping turn off crop and resize the picture so it's big enough see here this picture of the milk is a bit small so what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy and I'm going to paste so I have two versions of the same picture and then I'm going to crop this again just for the picture of the milk turn off crop and I've got a fairly big picture now of So now we've got fresh milk, one euro fourteen. We're going to get another product now. Back up to my search box, click on edit, delete the milk for bread. Click on go. Let's see all the different types of bread. So we'll choose this one here. Click print screen. Go to the Word document. Click on paste. and crop it turn off crop and resize okay, I'm going to copy this it in. I'm going to crop this one so I can make the picture of the bread bigger. 